Yo, yo, what's going on, everyone? It's your boy, Vintage Firearm Guy, back with another video. Happy Firearm Friday. Today, we're doing System Test 21 with the FCI panel. So, let's get started. So, obviously, like I said, nothing's changed. And also, one thing I want to mention, I have NAC2 wire back on. So, yep. So, <clears throat> let's get started. Last test we did the uh, the uh, 4903 stirrup plates and the Simplex 2901s. Well, those devices are taken down. If any of you guys watched that from the last test, but if any of you guys are new to this channel and haven't seen that video yet, um, I recommend go watching it. So, yep. So, and I tell you what, it's pretty cool. I mean, this wasn't too bad. So, I know I've, I know that video is probably gonna be pretty popular. Yeah, or something like that. So I'm just saying. <laughs> All right, anyway, enough shit chattering with that. Let's go on with our devices on the system. Over here, I took the 4251-21 down, and I got a new pulse station for the system. This is a Thorn uh, B5. Yep, it's a pretty nice pull. Fun fact, I got this pulse station brand new in box. So this thing was never used, never installed, so... It's always it's hard to come across one of these, especially if you get one new in box, so yeah. So yeah, anyway, that is the Thor B5. Over here, I replaced the Simplex Wiffle Ball Smoke, and I just put the Ansel Smoke Detector back up, pretty much for this test, just in case that detector ever decides to activate for obviously no reason, so I have this back up, so yeah. So anyway, that is the Smoke Detector. And for the last pull station, I have the Firelight B6. Yep, I figured I haven't used this pulsing too much, so why not use it, so. Yeah, I took the T-bars down, because I bet a lot of you guys can stick the T-bars, so I decided to change it up a little bit, so. Yep, so yeah, that is our that is our pulsations in the detector. Now, the alarms. Up here, I have my Simplex 2903 uh, flashing light plate. Yep, with the 29193 horn behind it. I'm going to tell you, this thing was a bit of a job to install, so I'm not going to be really using this alarm too much, but, I mean, yeah, you know, it's probably my first time using the 20 out 3 on the system, so, yep. Anyway, that is the 20 out 3 And then over here, I put up, I actually put up my uh, Space Age A32 with this back box back on it, so, yeah. I think you guys, I think we're back in System Test 12 since I've used this device. While this is test 21, we're going to go ahead and use this once again, so, yep, so that is the Space Egypt 32, and the 20 out 3, and yes, these are incandescent lights, so, I'm not going to be running these for too long, just in case if one of these bulbs, for for some other reason, decide to burn out or something like that, I don't want to fry the necks or destroy my panel by using these, so, I'm not sure I'm not going to run these for too long, so, yeah. But, anyway, that was our devices. Now, time for the activation. Start off with Thor V5. If you have epilepsy, do not watch. Here we go. Wow, it's pretty loud. <laughs> All right. Yeah, I might have to reset this off camera, so be right back. All right, so this is pulse inch reset. And like I said, you know, it was kind of a little harder set, especially with one hand, but not a lot of guys probably don't want to see me take forever just to try to reset a pulse station, so. But, yeah, all right. Reset that. And uh, I guess we'll do the BG6, so, yeah. All right, pulling down the BG6. Here we go. Holy noise. All right. Make him try to reset the BG6 uh, on camera. Can. Okay, and look at that. I, I probably can. I can see that down. Anyway, I guess it's not perfect, but all right. So that's been resetted. 
Now, reset the system. All right, and now the last thing we gotta do is activate the uh, detector. Yeah, sorry for all this big mess down here. We're doing kind of a go-kart project kind of thing in here, so. All right. Now I activate the Ansel smoke. Here we go. Yeah, it's pretty loud. <laughs> All right. All right, so that pretty much wraps up for System Test 21. Yep, the Space Age and the 20L3. They're pretty nice alarms if you ask me, so. Yep. So, next test. Um, I will still keep that 20L3 up. Except I think I'm going to move it over here. But, I think I am going to still keep the horn up or something like that, so, with the 20 out of 3, because I have another 20 out of 3 that's coming in, and I'm going to put the 93.3 on top of it. Yes, and it is a service about 20 out of 3, so, what does it look like? Well, you're going to have to stay tuned for the next system test, so. But anyway, guys, if y'all, that pretty much wraps up for this video. If y'all enjoyed this video, give this video a big thumbs up, drop a comment down below, and of course, subscribe to the channel.